hello <clears throat> i'm about to set off so you'll have to tolerate car noise for a minute um i won't waffle as as usual for me we are all going to the cinema today on this lovely sunny day probably into a completely empty cinema to see the garfield movie weird choice i hear you say we haven't seen Can Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes yet, if that's what it's called. I need my glasses because I'm going to start squinting in a minute. Is it the one of the Planet of the Apes? I have no idea what it is either. Not for the older ones. Um, I will see it eventually. We'll probably see it maybe this weekend coming up, as in the next one. Isaac's got a long weekend. It's off Friday and Monday. Um, the Strangers Chapter 1 has started, but... Given that every person I know that's seen it, and without exception, has said it is awful, it's terrible. It actually made Big Polly reviewed it. It was actually really funny because it made him angry. And I love nothing more than a really bad movie review. It's, I prefer them to a good one. He got really angry at it. Um, so I'm not wasting any money to go to see that. Given that me and Darren didn't really rate the Strangers movie, and everyone else seems to love it. We were like, well, it was all right, but it was a bit mediocre. So if people that think The Strangers is a good movie are saying this one's a terrible movie, I shall be giving it a miss at the cinema. I shall obviously watch it because it's a horror, um, but I shall be on streaming. So it's Garfield today. Um, and as always, when we come out, we shall let you know what we thought. I want lasagna for my tea. I want lasagna for my tea all the time. Let's just speak to you. Empty as usual, folks. Right, that's a sight of Garfield. Um, I'm not going to spend a day just talking to you. I find that really disappointing to the point of like, would have probably left if I'd been on my own. Yeah. Um, I think there were two bits in it I liked two very short bits not like massive just two short happenings the guy beside me fell asleep and snored yes i thought he did your dad said he hadn't well, i thought i'd heard around, him he was awake yeah he woke yeah, up again he but he was I doing really audible time. snoring yeah. and, like and darren fell asleep again multiple times it was um, awful it wasn't a good movie there was no wit no sarcasm there wasn't even any funny jokes in it. There was absolutely nothing. I cannot believe that's Garfield. Yeah. If you took Garfield out of it, I don't want my money back. It was that bad. So me and Darren um, remember Garfield from the days when the cartoon first came out. I've still got some books in it. I think I found them yesterday. Complete and utter like sarcasm, that sort of thing. Um, Dry wit. Yeah. So we absolutely love the sarcasm and wit of Garfield. Tell you what, I'm glad we didn't bring Isaac's mate to that because I'd have been embarrassed to bring a kid of that age. It's very much aimed at young children that don't know much about Garfield. I didn't like the animation, even though it looked okay, it didn't suit, you know, I'd have preferred normal cartoon animation than trying to have that sort of textured animation. Oh, I hated when, when they tried to be really stupid, like stuffing a whole pizza in my mouth at once, going, it's like, that's not funny. It made me hungry, I'll say that much, because they ate so much pizza and lasagna, and they ordered like desserts and stuff, and I was thinking, oh God, I could eat that. Yeah, and you've got your phone out, haven't you, and you're all in <laughs> way. Um, no, so I would suggest if you're an adult that remembers Garfield from the good old days, avoid it like the plague. Um, if you have children that are above the age of, I'd say, 10, even younger. Above the age of 8. 8, yeah. I'd say 8 and under, yeah, p potentially. I, I, actually, can I just step in there? I wouldn't take any kid to see that because it was boring. There was nothing funny in it. Yeah. There was nothing to keep a kid occupied. It was just crap. So pretty bad review from Meander yeah. and I would imagine Isaac, what did you think of it? I thought it was okay. It would have been a lot better, like you said, if that actually is sarcasm. That's the thing that makes Garfield funny. Yeah. I watched a couple episodes of the original like, series and yeah. it was really good because he's sarcastic with literally everything. Garfield Isaac. can't get out of his own bed in the books. He trips up and falls on his face. That's the joke every Monday morning. Yeah. Yeah, he's a bloody... What's that? Ninja. Yeah, he's an intern, that. It's like, eh. So, 
Isaac was the one that wanted now to be honest I would have wanted to see it because I love Garfield Darren would probably have been like me not bothered um but Isaac wanted to see it I do and like he, Garfield, he I just, yeah mm. same here but even Isaac said to me the main thing he was looking forward to was the sarcasm and there wasn't any um like I said there were two little short bits that I thought one I thought yeah I quite like that bit and another bit I thought was quite sweet but I mean, and the villain's just irritating. Um, a lot of the characters just weren't needed. There's like any sort of characters that are in it that you, you just, you know, the way you have other animal characters in movies and you get to know their personalities and, you know, you feel certain ways about them. You just don't feel any certain way about any of the other animals because they're just so insignificant. Garfield is if just a bit irritating. Odie is okay in the original cartoon. Odie is irritating, but in this... His whole character's completely different. Yeah. Um, I like Dodie and both, I'm going to say that. I just know. It, it's a big uh, uh from us. Uh, we we all thought, I thought it was terrible, to be quite honest with you. I would have left. I was about five minutes in, I'll turn around to look at you, I'm thinking, God, I hope you don't like this. I don't know what to say. Um, Absolutely. Well, be honest, <laughs> that's what you say. Never I don't be honest. I didn't want to spoil film for you while you were sat watching it. I was like, oh, Jesus Christ, this is terrible. No, well, I think we're on the same page there. It just was not good. It was too long. It was wet. I'm thinking, how the hell are children maintaining their interest for this? I'm bored senseless here. I lost interest. The start of the movie, I sort of, I'm not spoiling plot. Um, Garfield finds himself as a kitten alone in the streets and he sees John in an Italian restaurant and he sees him eating and that's where he discovers his love of lasagna and pizza. No, I like that bit. Um, because Garfield was Garfield, he was a kitten, he was learning about the food and stuff, and I thought, oh, well, I like this, and then I, from that point, I, I, no. From the point of the first five minutes, I just, no. I wasn't bored, I just found it not entertaining enough. I was bored. Very bored. I, if I had been there myself, I would have left, probably half an hour into the film. And I don't often say that. I generally sit through something, but that was it just was no redeeming features for me. I think if you knew the original series and you enjoyed the original series like we did and are big fans of it, I think you'd be even more disappointed than we were. This is a lot for the ego of your man that does the main voice. Chris Pratt. That he didn't actually say, what the hell's this script? <laughs> so he's getting paid, he didn't give a shit. Right, so um, with that, we do not recommend Garfield. No. If you think your kids will like it, if they like cats, potentially bring very young children to it. I wouldn't recommend older kids. Young children may have a struggle getting through. It's too long. Um, we can't think of very many redeeming features, unfortunately. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. Let us know if you've seen it below in the comments, what you thought. I only know two people that have seen it so far. That's Mike from Did You See That and Elliot from IMO Reviews. Elliot pretty much agreed with everything we've said he hated it now i'm sure if he's watching this he won't mind me saying elliot dislikes most things um so i'm like N -n -n -n. i wasn't sure but he's spot on in his synopsis of this mike was a little kinder but i know he was quite disappointed too John was crap on so thank you for watching guys let us know below in the comments if you think it looks crap well it is um and we'll be back at some stage with another come with me i'm sure i will at some stage get back to my um book lists and my weekly watches are a bit less frequent because i'm not watching quite as much but um yeah we shall be back at some there stage there's no coffee in it either was does garfield drink coffee garfield right, you see, you've doesn't get out of bed without coffee you've started it again now right yeah thank you for watching overnight <laughs>